so so people can find numerous resources for software engineering and other related fields however quant uh, quant profile have become the hot topic in india recently but there is a need of more uh, interview discussions for preparation strategies this video aim to fill the gap and provide valuable insights for those who are preparing for quant roles so welcome to the video today we have akshay who has successfully uh, cracked the quant profile in quandai uh, today he'll be sharing his placement journey and how he prepared for the quandai so let's welcome him and congratulate him for achieving this milestone so congratulations uh, akshay so uh, so before we dive in could you please introduce yourself to our audience so hello everyone i'm akshay padakanti from hyderabad and currently i'm studying in the fourth year in iit bombay computer science and i have received the pre placement offer in quadai which is a quant company based in gurgaon okay so now in a nutshell please share the key aspects of your internship preparation mm -hmm. so i started preparing for quant profile in the summers of second year before the interview process was inter internship process started before that i did not really know about the quant profile and i had recently learnt about it and i was told that it has more importance on the maths part especially probability and statistics so that piqued my interest and i started preparing for it okay so uh, what resources you refer while preparing for your internship uh, so the resources there are a few books and also a few websites the websites i mostly used for practicing uh, practicing brain teasers and puzzles one of them was brain stellar and another i think is called gurmeet puzzles and there was one book called uh, green book which had many probability topics and many questions and also and there was also one book called quant grading guide quant trading guide yeah so these two books were very helpful okay so is cpi a major criteria mm actually it is one of the major criteria they uh, most of the quant companies take the top top drs and also they have a strict cut off of 9 or 8.8 cpi okay so what's your cpi back then uh, mine was 9.2 around 9.2 back then so is it true that they also focus on your je rank while selecting mm -hmm. yes even je rank is somewhat important uh, mm -hmm. and most of the quant companies take only from the top iits and also they focus on the maths and cs branches so je rank is actually important so uh, apart from cs mm. did they also take students from math mathematics and com yes i think in uh, from iit bombay they took two people from maths and one from electrical physics sorry engineering physics okay yeah, and most of them most of the others were from csc okay did you really like the quant profile or did you just go with this for the high salary so yeah so i had recently learned about the quant profile and it was very interesting to me so i had to try it out and also the money was one of the factors so do you want to reveal your package here uh, so i i can tell you it is around the base is 50 lakhs okay, is it say ctc no no base base is 50 lakhs yeah uh, okay. Uh, since dsa is such a hot topic among students mm. so is it really important for this quant uh, perspective mm, for quant it is not as important as the other software profiles mm. and even in even in the quant companies there are uh, the software profile requires more uh, like in quant companies the software profile requires the dsa requires dsa knowledge but for the quant profile it is not that important okay for if uh, somebody is going into the software stuff mm. then dsa is much required yeah and for the software profiles they also focus on c++ fundamentals so mm. you need to know you need to know the c++ fundamentals really well okay mm. so how about the cv like uh, do they really focus on your cv uh, like do they consider it or just by your skills or the talent matters here? like uh, how much a cv uh, how much important a cv play in the and getting the internship or the uh, job role i think it is one it is not that important but it is still like the projects are still very necessary for the interviews mm -hmm. they even ask some questions based on this okay 
so mm. so as you mentioned the projects so mm. can you share any interesting project you worked on during your internship mm. so in during the internship my team had four members my sub team had four members and our task was to come up with successful uh, strategies using new, live news so what we had to do was we had an api which would give us live news feed from many different sources and we did sentiment analysis on it using nlp to get the get the company which was which the news was referring to and also the uh, sentiment if it was good for the company or bad for the company and then we traded using that okay so how was your interview uh, how was your interview experience what was the structure of that interview was it scary uh, it was not scary but a bit intimidating okay so for the quant profile there were three separate rounds the first one had basic probability questions second one had somewhat harder probability questions and some advanced topics mm -hmm. and finally there was hr round okay and for the software profile they for the software profile i only gave the first round i don't know after what i don't know the process after that okay so what they focus more on your interview like what kind of questions they ask you what in the interview in the like as i told you mostly probability questions did you do competitive programming uh, what is your current rating on any major platform uh Uh, so i did practice competitive programming for the uh, for the internships for the software profiles mm -hmm. i i had around 1600 rating in the code forces platform okay so uh, what they ask you in their tests uh, is there any test uh, uh, specific to quant profile or if there is then what they ask for the you? other for uh, for companies like optiver jane street they have a test which like even for that there is some criteria for selection okay. but for quota there was no test only directly interview okay so is there any criteria to be selected in that interview how they select you for yeah. the interviews so it was mostly cpi and j rank and other projects okay. for software uh, and for quant mostly j rank and cpi yeah, yeah. that means we can say that your selection is dependent on your cv and then uh, whether you get the uh, uh job role or not it depends on, on your uh, skills yes now uh, like mostly on the interview side mm. that's great so as uh, you mentioned few books which you referred there mm. so do, did you solve all the problems of the book that you mentioned uh i did not solve all the problems i just skimmed through the important topics and did some of the practice problems okay. so it is important to know the topics well and like the problems are Like you can solve the problems if you know the topic well. So, what is the best resource for someone who is preparing for controls? Hmm. Is it like uh, they should prefer books or any website, any YouTube channel or something? No, uh, I think it should be a mix of all of them. I, as I told you, there is one book called Quant Trading Guide, and that that has everything about the interview process, all the types of questions, and what kind of preparation you should do. So. you should have a look on look on that okay any uh, youtube channel which you prefer for mathematical reasoning skills or the probability stuff uh, no i did not refer to any youtube channel okay be fine so as a, like as the conversation is telling you are a bright student mm -hmm. so i have a very curious question which i want to ask you that uh, class jate the ya nahi uh, utna sincerely nahi jata tha but okay. kabhi kabhi jata tha okay <laughs> So, ये क्या नोशन है कि आई टी में सभी स्टूडेंट्स बहुत स्मार्ट होते हैं इज इट ट्रू आई डोंट थिंक दैट इज कम्प्लीटली ट्रू बट आई आई टी एन स्टूडेंट शुड टिपिकली बी स्मार्टर देन दी एवरेज ओके ओके सो कैन यू गिव मी एनी स्टार्ट लाइक हाउ मेनी पीपल आर सेलेक्टेड फ्रॉम योर बैच इन कॉन्टाई uh so during uh, in my batch there were around 30 31 people who got selected for the internship okay and out of those 12 people or 13 people got the ppo okay or any uh, how many are in the software roles 
In this so these are you, these are you are telling the start of control. Yeah? No, no, total, including okay. everything. Okay. So for for the internship, I think nine or ten people were software and twenty were font profile. Okay. Yeah. So which have uh, more money? Uh, I think font, font mostly. Okay. So this is the last semester. So yeah. how are you feel? How are you feeling now? Mm. So last semester, everyone has a mix of emotions. Like we still want to be in the college for more time. We only have two months left, yeah. and also we want to continue on our journey and start start something new. So are you excited for the life ahead? Yeah, of are, course. Everyone is. Like, are you missing? Like, will you miss the these old days of, your, of yeah. yours in the industry? Hmm. Okay. So, uh, one last advice or tip which you want to give to the students who are listening to you, like any additional uh, advice who are preparing for quant role. Uh, so, for quant roles, I would suggest you should practice probability properly and statistics also, and and you should also try solving different brain teasers and puzzles from anywhere you can find them. Even in YouTube, there are many channels which post riddles and all. And in quant, there are those are very common. Uh, like those are very those are asked very commonly in the interviews. Yeah. Okay. So thank you, Akshay, for joining in this episode. Hope mm-hmm. your insights will be valuable for and people will get the insights mm-hmm. uh, to for the preparation in the journey mm-hmm. for placement or in in the internship. Mm-hmm. So I hope our audience find value in this. So I'm putting. Uh, his linkedin id in the description please check and follow and if you have any doubts in regarding the quant uh, stuff you can just ask in the comment section and uh, follow for more like share and subscribe for the algorithm and i'll hope to see you in the next video so bye bye for now mm-hmm.